Hello there, my name's Scott. Today I'm going to be doing a review, not on a uh, electronic cigarette as such, but um, on what's called a PCC from the uh, www.electroniccigarette.co.uk. Now I've recently done a review on the uh, Titan e-cig, which is one of these. Uh, I'll just quickly show you what it's like. And uh, well, that's your Titan electronic cigarette. Now, when you buy one of these, um, in the review I said you can either buy in one or two packages. You can either buy it just like the standard sort of uh, package where it comes with uh, two batteries and two atomizers, or you can buy one of these, which is called a, a PCC. PCC stands for uh, personal charging case. Now, what the idea of this is, is that basically uh, you charge the actual unit up, uh, so it's, once it's fully um, charged, then you can um, put your Titan electronic cigarette in there, the battery. Every time you put the battery in there, it'll automatically start charging it out without needing to plug it into the mains. So I'll just uh, go through and show you what, uh, how it comes. Uh, obviously it comes in a packaging like this. You do get a uh, USB cable that was very neatly um, put inside there as well, but I can't get it back in there now. And you also receive a USB um, mains adapter as well. So you can either plug this directly into your, like your computer, to charge it up or you can plug it into the mains to charge it up. Now when I received this I didn't actually realise that inside actually you actually get another full Titan package in there but you only get one atomizer uh, and one uh, battery and two cartridges. Um, so all you have to do basically the compartments here you've got two there which uh, control your which uh, hold your cartridges and you've got uh, one hole which then you can place your atomizer into and you've got another hole which you plug your battery in. So I'm just going to um, switch to a bit of a closer view so you can get a closer idea of it. Now with this, normally with uh, electronic uh, cigarette batteries, you have to charge it, you normally have to screw it into place. Now this has got a really neat, uh, neat way of doing it. All you have to do, if I find it, all you have to do is drop it into the hole and close the lid. And then now you should be able to see that little red light comes on. Now when that red light on is on but not flashing, so it's just a still uh, red LED, that means that your battery needs charging and it's currently charging it up as we speak. As soon as that little red light starts flashing, which I think it is now, that means that the battery is fully charged. Obviously I have had this battery in there charging away um, like for the last little couple of hours, so that's fully charged now. Uh, this second light down here, uh, when your actual whole unit needs to, um, is basically running out of its charge, then that red li uh, that light will light up in the middle there, and that will light up a constant red to let you know that it's time to re actually uh, recharge the actual unit. This red light at the bottom, when you plug this into your, um, when you plug it into the PC or to the mains, the light at the bottom will go red to indicate that the whole unit is charging. It will charge the battery at the same time as well as charging the unit as well. And then once that light at the bottom goes green, that means that the whole PCC is fully charged and is ready for you to use. Now, uh, the PCC will charge four batteries completely from dead. So in other words, you can have four completely, um, you know, like uh, spent batteries. You can put them in there one after another and it will charge every battery, all those four batteries up uh, completely fully charged again. Um, but what you're going to really use for this is for like, um, uh, say if you was like at work or something like that, you take it out, treat it, if you're treating it like a cigarette, you can take it out, screw it into the atomizer, start puffing away, and then once you've finished, put that back in the case, and then it will automatically start charging it again. It detects if there's, a, if there's enough charge in the battery. If it's below a certain voltage, then it'll automatically start charging and it will shut itself off once the charge has actually been completed. Now, if you're treating it like that, you probably only have to charge this unit up maybe once a week, if that, because you know just that one full charge, that can charge up four uh, batteries from dead to full. So if you're just treating it as though like, um, like a cigarette box where you'd like, you know, you'd carry it around with you, uh, then take out a cigarette, smoke it, or take out the electronic cigarette, have a vape on it. Once you've got your nicotine cravings done, you then put your battery back into the charger bit and your atomizer back into its place. Then it's only going to be actually using a very tiny amount of the actual PCC's charge. So, like, um, you know, it, they could last you a very long time. Indeed, I reckon it's going to, well, I've had it like pretty much for about a week now using it like that. And I've also, on top of that, I've. Um, have completely charged four full batteries without having to recharge the actual unit. So it does like the on the instructions it does say you know it can charge four plus batteries. I've made it pretty much sort of four batteries uh, bang on. Um, so the only thing that I don't like about this though 
it's the hinge. You have the little button here, little silver button here on the side down. This one's just sort of part of the, um, it doesn't actually do anything. And these two little silver buttons don't do anything there. They're just actually part of the hinge mechanism. With this silver bat uh, button here, when you press that, that'll open the lid. And if you just watch this, I don't like that. That's the only thing I don't like about this unit, is you press the button and it's, it's almost like a mouse trap going off. You know, if they could do that, so it was like a slow release, so you press it and it's, it's open like that, it would look, you know, that would be such a, a better design. But it is just basically just a sprung loaded, uh, um, you know the word, I mean, the sprung, a spring, <laughs> let's just call it a spring. Hinge, that's the word, it's just a sprung loaded hinge, so you press the button. So I would recommend, I don't know how much sort of abuse that will take if you keep on doing that over and over again, so I recommend if you're going to get one of these, just put your finger on the top, press the button and just let it release like that, and I think the hinge will actually last you a lot longer that way. Um, underneath here you have the uh, the small um, um, a USB uh, plug, so you can plug it into your PC, or if you can, like I said, it comes with the cable as well as the mains plug, so you can plug it into your into the mains as well. So you just put your USB cable into there, the other end into your PC or into the mains adapter, and charge away. It takes four hours to get a fully charged PCC. Like I said, after that, then you've got enough power there to be able to, um, you know, charge four full batteries from dead. Or, like I said, if you treat it like how I think it's meant to be designed, which is, you know, you have, you're using it as a, uh, you know, to crave, uh, get your nicotine cravings, put it back into the case, and then, like, that little bit of charge that you used up, you've used up over those five, ten minutes of vaping, that'll be fully charged again. So, you basically, you can go, you know, like a week without ever having to worry about sort of charging out your batteries again. Um, now, for me, like, I'm a plasterer, so I work in the building trade, or, like, the construction trade. And something like this, it's a very sturdy case indeed, it's made out of metal, it's not a bit of cheap plastic, it's made out of a nice solid metal there, and for me, like in my trailer, I get knocked about quite a bit, and I have bits of ceilings falling down on top of me, and I know with this, with my uh, Titan in there, uh, you know, it's going to be fully protected, and also it's going to keep it fully charged, you know, if you're a, a plumber, a sparky, uh, you know, chippy, or, or a plaster like myself, then I, you know, then you're into like, you're smoking electronic cigarettes, and I you know, highly recommend one of these to, to keep it nice and safe and fully charged at the same time. Unfortunately, it will only charge the Titan. Uh, I've not actually tried any um, other electronic cigarettes in there, but you know, it, it does say that it's only designed specifically for the Titan or the Joy 510, which um, is the, basically the model number there. And I think like Dura may work in it as well. I'm not 100% sure on that though. So um, there you go, that's your PCC, that's how to use it. Uh, the reason I went to sort of make a point of showing you how to use it is because the instructions are extremely um, complicated. It goes into uh, where was it? Like a lot of detail which it just doesn't need to be there going on about oh, when BT1 va uh, voltage goes down to 3.34 volts, this light shows red to show that 4.2 volts is present. Like, the average Joe is not going to give a toss about that. He wants to know is what do these lights mean. And they could have just made it so much easier if they just said, oh, light A will turn green when fully charged, uh, light B will flash to indicate that the battery is fully charged. So all you need to know is the top one now um, it will stay red permanently uh, while, the, while the actual Titan battery is charging. It will flash red to let you know that it's fully charged. The middle button will light fully red and stay lit red to indicate that the actual unit itself needs to be charged. The one at the bottom, when it's lit red, that indicates that the actual unit is being charged by the via the PC or the computer or the uh, or the mains. When it turns green, that means that the whole uh, unit is fully charged. That's all you need to know. Far more easier and uh, less complicated than reading those uh, instructions. Okay, so there's the PCC. If you're interested in one, go to www.electroniccigarette.co.uk. If you type in this code, that'll give you a five percent discount on your purchases. Okay, thank you for watching and uh, happy vaping. See you later. <laughs>